Hi, in this video I'll be showing you how to find data on the Community Data Program website. The first thing that you'll want to do is click the Find Data button at the top of the page. This will bring you to the catalog where you'll be presented with a series of filters that you can use to search for data. The first is Topics, which gives you a list of categories and subcategories that you can pick from to be shown all the data products that fit under them. Product Group lets you search by the product group that the data is from. So for example, if you're looking for census data from a certain year, you can use this filter. Data Provider is helpful if you're looking for data from a specific source, but you'll find that most of the data in the catalog comes from Statistics Canada. Product Title is best used when you know the exact title of the product you're looking for, or if you're looking for a keyword in the title. Multi-word searches don't work as well here as it needs an exact match with the text of a product's title for it to show up in the results. Geographies lets you search by geographic scale, such as postal code, province, or census tract. And years within data lets you search by the year that the data is for. When searching, it's best to start with one filter and then add more as needed. When using multiple filters, the search results will only include data products that fit under the selections for every filter you've used. This can quickly narrow your search down to very few or even zero results. Generally, one filter is enough, at least to get you started. For example, if you select Census 2016 Data Tables for the product group, you will already be narrowed down to 35 results. If you'd like to narrow your search further, you can add more filters, for example, adding Demographics under Topic. This will show you any 2016 Census Data Tables that fit under this category. If you want to broaden your search, you can either remove filters or add more selections under the filters you're already using. Using multiple selections in the same filter will show you any data product that matches with any one of your selections. Another thing to note is that you should avoid contradictions when searching. For example, if you selected 2016 census data tables for the product group, but set the years within data to 2006, then you won't get any results. Once you've found a data product that looks like it fits your needs, you can click on it to see its metadata, which will give you more information. Here you can generally find a description and a list of the dimensions in the data set. Clicking a dimension will show you all the variables it contains, which will give you an idea of exactly what information is found in the data product. On the products page, you can also find information such as file format and file size. If you're satisfied with your choice, you can select the geographic scale you wish to download, add it to your cart, then select checkout. Once you've completed the order, you can download it from the Files tab on your account page, and you're good to go.